friends welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to make a white sauce and chicken sandwiches uh, it's a it's an open sandwich and we are going to bake it in the oven and if you do not have an oven you can even make it on your normal tawa so for that we first need to make the white sauce and then we're going to assemble the chicken and the vegetables into the white sauce so let me show you the ingredients over so here for the white sauce I'm going to need two teaspoons of all-purpose flour I have taken a glass of milk but you may vary according to the consistency of the white sauce you want. I am going to cook the white sauce into olive oil but you may even use a bit of butter. I have taken half a teaspoon of ginger garlic paste. I have taken half a teaspoon of salt or you may take according to taste and half a teaspoon of black pepper powder. Here I have got about 150 grams of chicken which I have boiled and shredded. I have not added any uh, salt and pepper or ginger garlic while boiling it. So it's just plain chicken. I have chicken. taken half a cup of capsicum. I have taken about one capsicum and then cut it into thin strips. You may take red capsicum. It will just look very fabulous. And then I have taken half a cup of sweet corn, some cheese which is totally optional and then the bread slices according to the number of uh, toast or uh, sandwiches you want. These ingredients I am also going to need some butter and, and oil into my pan. And now you have to be very careful if you are a beginner then make sure that your heat is at the minimum or you can heat your oil and then turn off the flame. So I am going to add the maida and we are just going to stir it and we are going to stir it till uh, the maida gives out a very beautiful all purpose flour has started giving out very good aroma so now I am going to add the milk and when you are adding the milk make sure that you are stirring constantly because we do not want to form any lumps so just make sure the flame is at low and you are stirring constantly so that no lumps are formed and at the same time I am going to add the seasoning of the ginger garlic paste and the salt and the black pepper as you see there are absolutely no lumps so we want it like this now we are going to cook only till the sauce starts Stage. thickening I suggest that you do a taste test. I have added the parsley over here and as you can see the consistency is changing. It's becoming thick so now I am going to add the boiled and shredded chicken, the capsicum and the sweet corn and you can always skip the chicken and add some other vegetables of your choice like spring onions, some sauteed mushrooms. So I'll just let it become a bit When more. you see the sauce has started bubbling, I suggest that you switch off the flame and uh, don't cook it much more and don't make it more thick because once it will cool down, the sauce will become thick itself. Cut the bread diagonally into two halves and I have applied a very scarce layer of butter and toasted it. I toasted it in the, in the oven. I gave three minutes on each side but you can always toast it on the pan or in the toaster. Before we proceed for making the sandwiches, let me remind you that you have to preheat your oven at 180 degrees centigrade and here our toasted breads are ready like I showed you before and here my white sauce and chicken layer is ready as we are going to layer it on the bread. As you can see it's cooled down completely and it has become thick and this is the cheese that we are going to use. It's totally optional. So I have taken a slice of bread and we are going to apply a good layer of the white sauce over it and make sure that you spread it evenly towards the entire bread and likewise I'm going to spread it on all the other slices and then arrange it on the baking tray I have arranged the bread and now we're going to spread cheese over the sandwiches and then we're going to bake them in a preheated oven at 180 degrees centigrade for about 7 to 8 minutes or until the cheese melts and so becomes cool the white sauce chicken sandwiches are ready some with cheese and some without cheese as you can see the one with cheese has got a good appearance and the one without cheese has just become a little darker. Uh, so guys do give it a try. Post me your comments and share my videos with your family and friends. And do like us on Facebook and subscribe to my channel. And thank you for watching my video.